How y'all doing this evening? Ooh, it's beautiful out tonight. Um, y'all see what's going on, right? In Europe. Yeah. They're pulling their politicians. Well, those politicians are all paid by all these world WF people and all that shit. Yeah, paid by all these built whatever. All these politicians have sold their souls. Yeah. And the, and their people. Their people will suffer. Not the politicians. No, nope, no, nope, they'll run. Yep. But the people will be there and stuck. Yeah. I have a feeling me and President Putin will be having lunch one day in Berlin. That's sad. Yep. But look what they've done there. Yep. The people don't want this to... The people... Most of these countries, the people don't want none of this to go on. The politicians have fully taken over. And their militaries and the people are just... They must... And that's another thing. All these military, the complacent people... Going along with all this stuff. And you know what's going on over there in Ukraine. Yep. Russia is liberating them. Yep, that is exactly what's going on right now. Oh. And you know, they wanted to isolate Russia. But that didn't work. So that's how they did with all the Germany. All that was planned to get, they won at Germany. They pulled them in. All this was happening. You know, they had people in people's ears. And this is all done staged. Yep, actors. These are all actors, these politicians. Yep. Yep. Germany could have run the world, ruled the world. Yep. That wasn't going to happen. See what I'm saying? But it strengthened Russia. Because Russia had to be where they're at right now, at their strongest. Yeah, they surely are. And there is no death. So it's a heroic one to die in battle. It surely is. Hell yeah. Protecting your, protecting your motherland, and that's exactly what the Russians are doing. You have no business in Ukraine, NATO, in America, and all you people. Yeah, you're all pigs. And you'll pay karma. Yeah. They know about us. They know our ships are up there. Yeah, all the signals and shit. And we do everything. Fly around. Let them take pictures of us. Blow up their missiles and shit. You know? Push things around. Hmm. Yep. See? If we just came down and showed you all, you wouldn't... It wouldn't... There'd be no faith. Yeah. God has an army. Yep, he's down. She's, they're down here. They surely are. They're getting ready too. Yeah. No, not right now, Kitty. Yeah, no. But um, yeah, I'm getting ready. Mm. You know, there's this paper here. What's that? It says reports Fauci's a jailhouse bully. This is a white kid, right? You know how many black kids are there jailhouse bullying? But you get this guy right here, right? This guy. Is probably suffering horribly, kid. In this horrible world. Whatever he did, I didn't even look. Doesn't matter. You know, the children are destroyed. Yep. Done it. Blame it on everybody else but yourselves. Yep. You're sick people. Yeah. You got six year olds shooting, shooting teachers. Hmm. I remember, not right now, Kitty. I was bullied horribly by my teachers. Horrible. I hated to go to school. Yeah, they just single me out. Yeah, the ones that shine the most and are, are different, original. I was at very. I wanted to help everybody. You know, I was one of those kids. <sighs> Treated 
Mm. Yeah. And then if you get a teacher to treat one, then the kids believe, you get me? Then it's like open season on them. Yeah. The teacher will, it, it, it's crazy. Yeah. Mm, and you guys don't see it. No, you just see the end here. Oh, well, that's what happened. You don't want to see what's behind it. You know, I was talking about thinking about that, that guy, a seal. Was that high, when I don't know who he's dating, high school and married to or something. You know, he's like, oh, he hit her or something like that. You know, and I think about it. I'm like, you know, I'm going to tell you this, man. I mean, I've made completely different. But if I wasn't, and I'm going to tell you, I've been justified to slap a bunch of times. <laughs> you get me? And fully justified. But I didn't take it. Punched myself, though. I'm not just rung my own bell. You know? But I could see. You understand? You've got weak men and weak women having kids. And usually single people now. That's how they're doing it. And just get kidding. Yeah, yeah. Ow. Um. Hold on a second. God dang it. That cat wants in the room, that wants in the house. <laughs> He's about to bite me. Yeah, it's crazy. Yep. See, the animals are not what you think. Yep. That cat's a protector of me and my family. Yep. See, all the animals and insects and all that stuff here, the birds and all that, right? <sighs> Group souls. Yep. See now Star Wars has all those different people in there? There's different worlds like that. Yeah. And their spirits come down here. Yep. Yeah. And then when you all treat them like you do, torture and kill for just a trophy and to look cool. Yep. Yeah. It's all this unjustified slaughter what it is all these shitty places all these shitty little takeout restaurants that have mass crap being forced down your mouth when you should be going away from all that crap yep it makes you lazy and fat surely does yep you guys are going in the wrong way so you know Bill Gates and all this stuff I'm gonna tell you these are people are evil Yep, Elon Musk, man. I tell you, he was sent in there. What? Look what's going on. They wanted people to quit. Then Google, all this stuff going on. It's been two years since that dumbass been in. All right? Just a puppet. And not even Obama's puppet. Obama, Obama's a puppet. That's all what else. You go, you, see, you're... you're and, oh, and Biden doesn't even know where he's at. You know how they kept um, Hitler going, man. They just drugged him up. Got him up kept him going. That's what they're doing with these people. It's sad. He's like a potato. Um, I, can, I don't even watch, you see, I don't even watch all this stuff, all this silly stuff. I don't know, Tucker Carlson has some the alien looking, whatever, dude. Yeah, but they don't want to talk to me, though. Real alien. Yep. Yep. <sighs> see, they don't want the truth. I make these people look like, look silly. Yeah, and that's what they want to do to people. They want to make themselves look big. No, people aren't helping by all this crazy, all this silly sideshow stuff. It's carnival. Yeah. You no, know, you're not helping. Getting in the way. That's why it's like I'm. I'm glad I'm watching all this for the last three years. I've been making these videos at least, and um, I've answered every question. But really, a bit of all these books, crazy. Yep. That's yeah, amazing. Huh. <sighs> I mean, you watch it unfold from when I first happened and then to now. Hmm. And they know. That's why they're afraid. But they've got you guys twisted so badly. 
Russia is not your enemy. These people are not your enemy. Just like American people are not Russians, you know, it's like weird. Just, but they're trying to villainize, oh, just keep you separate. Like Red Dawn, that was, that was totally, you know, that was them, that was America. <laughs> that was what they want to do. You get me? Projection right there, buddy. You know? They live simple lives in, in Russia. I, like, I had a neighbor in, in Palm Coast, he was a nice guy. You know, him and his son got in a, adult son got in a fight in the front yard. The cops came, and they're like, why do cops come here, you know? It's a fucking, they, they were a drinking problem, and, you know, I'm sure, whatever. You know, it wasn't, a, I think it was a, it was a fair fight. <laughs> but, um, do you know what I mean? I mean, uh, you got no business in people's families like that. Stuff like this. It's like, uh, yep, you've overstepped your bounds, and the cops love it, man. Yep. They hate the fact that they can't smell weed. They go, oh, I smell weed. It's like taking away from something, dude. They're, it's crazy. These people are out to get you. I mean, these these most of these cops, and I see this, they're not the best, man. They're like the kids in school that like got bullied or didn't get anything. And and I've met a, a lot of women I've known that were with with police officers said they were beaten by them. Yep, they were. Yep. Yeah. I remember. Oh. I'm telling you, it's the weakest men that are the um, are the most cruel. No, strong men aren't like this. I don't like that. No. Like, if you get a real military guy that's really seen combat and shit, and, I mean, and not like a fool, you know? I, I, that's the thing about the military now. It's so, I can't believe all the lives I've seen, I've, that have been told. And that's sad. I feel bad for all these, all these, you know, just the low-end military people out there that just have no idea what their government's doing. But I can understand, you know, you want to fall in and whatever and, but man, it's become radicalized. You never should hate anyone. Uh, never. Nope, there's no reason for it. Nope, it doesn't fix anything. Only love can bridge things together. Huh? Yep. Not this separation. You know, this wasn't meant to be like this. Not the borders and, and it wasn't meant to be like this. The reason, and the reason it's like that is because you've got sick people in society that are greedy. At least there's a small percentage of these people are like wicked reptiles, man. Demonic people. That, believe me, all these like, um, um, because the Rosicrucians and the Freemasons are, are watching me. But there's many, many, many more. You know, and like the things I talk about with Rudolf Steiner, there's books that are not shown <laughs> in public that will tell you everything. Everything that I'm talking about is written down already. This all came from here, though, you know. All the God stuff. Yep. It was completely psychological. All psych, all psychoanalytical, you know. That's all I did. You know, and I tried to understand religion. That's what I went through. You know. And then when they turned me on at 6 9 when all them ships were over the house, you know. The meteor fucking pow, boom. You know, all of a sudden I'm crying. Cause I felt like the weight of the world was off me. Because I couldn't get out there, you know. My messages couldn't get out there. And then they turboed me, man. I'm telling you, man, there's like a heat inside me. And it can come up just like that. It's like Superman. Yep. But times a thousand. Yep. It's crazy. God filled. Yep. Powerful. Yep. You know, that's why I was with my ex and all these, I had to be, with, it had to be like that, you know, like my ex was so bad, you know, it was so bad, and um, I remember, I just wanted to, I literally married her just so I had, you know, so I, she couldn't run from me again with the kids, so, um, because that's the only way you can have rights, so I called a lawyer, he's like, man, you got, you got enough money to hire me, so he's like, best thing to do is marry her. <laughs> And I took the lawyer's advice. And I said, oh, you know, and then she couldn't take off. So I ended up, you know, but it's crazy. You have to do this shit. And, um, and I wasn't going to bring another woman in to the relationship with my kids. And I knew that. I didn't want Michelle to lose herself because even though I didn't want to be with her, I wanted her, I didn't want her, I wanted her safe. She was with me, but she was a whore. But <laughs> I knew that, you know, I, I know what she's doing. You know, I just wish she wasn't so dirty. You know, it was really, it was, it was really disturbing how dirty someone can be, someone can get. 
over drugs and money and just, just uh and I tried to help her and all these dudes I caught, caught them like sleeping around and shit I caught them I don't fight I'm not gonna beat you up over that shit they, they, people don't understand I don't that's why I never started fights because if I fight I'm hurting you it's gonna be pain I don't like it's not like a people probably surprised everybody I've ever fought I'm not fighting I'm fighting to kill you and then you stop and I let go it's all of a sudden everything turns off again yeah turn into a complete animal yep like a predator, dude. It turns me right. It's weird. It's like, boom, everything just, yeah. So, all you people out there, all, them, all you guys out there, maybe you're lucky, you know. <laughs> so, don't think I was stupid. I just didn't. There's no reason to fight anybody, and I was really trying to save her, you know. I gave up like seven years ago, it was. So, I tried for like three years, man, to save her after we separated and it was just horrific to watch the, it was hor to watch it, you know. And then I had seen her like a year. This was right after, right after I hit my, you know, Easter and I hit my eye. And she lured, her sister lured me over there and she tried to murder me. And it set up everything. I had cops called, it was crazy. But I didn't react like I would normally react. Because I remember I was driving out there. I didn't want to be there. I didn't talk to her in a long time. Nothing to say to her. And um, I said, if anything happens, I'm going to call the cops. My brain just said that. I'm not going to do my normal things like hurt people or try whatever it is. And I'm, yeah, that's what I did. And I followed because they were it was self, totally set up. And I pulled in. I was there for like a couple minutes. And then another dude, truck pulled in behind me. Dude comes in, rah, 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 starts something, sets some beers down, walk up. And she runs out. And they pulled it. Then he goes, I got, he's, he's got a gun. And I, I didn't go, because I couldn't see. That was another thing. I couldn't see, so I stopped in the light so I could see. Because I, I my eyes were dilated. I'd just been to the doctor, too, that day. And I had my eyes dilated, so I couldn't see. And I would see how it is, man. My, that, everything happens for a reason, man. And I stopped. And I called the cops. And then I saw him walking up. And I had a gun, dude. And everything tucked in like it was weird. And, um... But I really couldn't see it, but I, I could see how they were holding things, you know, and she was, you know, she was trying to get him to, it was, it was weird. She was on meth. She was so lost. I'm not even going to get into the lap, but that, she was so lost, you know, and um, I was like, I'm on, the, I'm on the phone with the cops, you know, then they fucking scattered, you know, she's like, uh, uh, and I'm like, you said to come over here. What are you, uh, and then Michelle walks over towards me, you know, and then uh, he jumps in the truck and leaves. Cops come, and I tell them what's going on. They're like, what? They're like, you know, and me, I didn't really get it, man, until a while later. It was like, I, had to, I didn't really think that she would do that. But, and then it's like, oh, my God. It's like, but like a light bulb went up my head. But it wasn't her. It was like the meth and the, and, because she didn't even know. I was, it was crazy. And then I went, you know, I went inside her house after the cops left. And the dog came over and sat on me, you know, and I never never met the dog. I think I met him like once or twice when I dropped the kids off. And he came and sat on me, pit bull, and she came and sat next to me, and he growled at her. He did not want her touching me. And he goes, oh, he's jealous. And I'm like, because she was messed up. The dog was looking at her like, I'm going to rip your throat out. And this dog been living with her for like four years. Oh, you know. So it's like I have all the backup stories, people I've met, done, all the all the trials and stuff I've been through. Everything I'm saying is true. You look up everything I said, everything. I'm the truth. That's why y'all hide from me. That's why I don't like the, those. Uh, that's when I got out of these media places, all these um, news places. I'm like, no, these people are 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 evil. Yeah. You don't think that. Every news place has heard of me. Really. Look at all the things I talk about. No. Nope. Second coming of Christ. Right here. Hmm. Yeah. But it's bigger than just me. No. Nope. I'm just a just a messenger. Mm-hmm. Yeah. God isn't happy. 
He is not. Nope. He's not happy with Buddhist, Muslims, um, Christians, any of you. He is not. You have steered away from God. Um, it's the final countdown yeah surely is Eric is pissed yeah she women can see real clair clairvoyant women that's another thing clairvoyant people know I'm here they feel me they feel my presence yeah that's what's funny about things um clairvoyant people can see all the shine for me but um what is it? Uh, it's disgusting what churches have become. Yep, I never cared for them, but I took my kids there and I went to people just for you know to see and and I'm telling you, man, the hate I see in there. Yeah, God put everybody here for a reason. And you have twisted it. Yeah. We are feminine and masculine beings. Yeah. We reincarnate. We come down here as a male. And then the next one will be a female. And uh, maybe this time we'll come back as someone with Down syndrome. Or maybe um, we'll be born in a different culture. Um, all of it has a purpose. To build up the spirit inside. So it had nothing to do with the flesh. And like sex to me, that's not you know, that's another thing. I never cared about Michelle's past. I cared what she was doing then just because it was it was affecting her and the or the way she was living. And um But sex without love is nothing. It surely isn't. You know, me and Erica are lovers. Most people are whores. Yeah. When I did that, when I was with people, I'm the most compassionate, a tentative person, and I just want to give that person the best experience. You know what I'm talking about? That was what my, my whole thing was. Completely wait for that. It was always them first. Yep. And she's the same way, you know. <clears throat> and then other people have ill intentions, just they're doing it for the wrong reasons. You know, I, had, I, I did, I slept a lot, of, but I was never nasty to the people. Never, 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 never lied like, you know, it wasn't like that. Straightforward people. It wasn't like, they knew I wasn't, that, you know, I wasn't just with one person. I was I dated. You know what I'm saying? It, I didn't really... Erica was really the, the one I really wanted to be with. But when I, whatever happened with me and her sister, that was a, the biggest one of the biggest mistakes I made. Well, not a mistake. None of it was a mistake. See? That's another thing. There is no mistakes. That's how I have to look at that. Because if that wouldn't have happened, I would have never given up on Erica. But when I did that, and I put me and, and her sister and that whole thing, I knew it would never work out. You get me? And I was angry at myself. So, like when her sister died, I wanted to be there for her so bad, but I knew I'd screwed that, that opportunity up, you know? Yeah. I, I, every, everything that ever happens to me is a lesson. So, there's no mistakes when I say that, but it's, it's what you think are. We truly live our lives in reverse. Nobody wants to look at their own selves in the mirror anymore. No one. No, they want to blame everybody else. They want to have some type of reason that they're oppressed or they're not doing well or hap un unhappy or whatever. You know, and all these hateful people out there. Hate does not come from love. love no. Now, if you truly love some, if you're a truly loving person, like the, all the animals and stuff, there's no, there's no hate. No. No. 
So, and all you people are out there, and you're spewing all them nasty negative things this way, racist this way, white people, black people, blah, blah, blah. Nope. It's mostly black people now. It's crazy. Can't believe how bad it's gotten. But I actually can. Because <laughs> I do understand. I've, I've, I've read. I know. I've studied it all enough. But, um, yep. Uh, they have literally hidden the, the truth from you this whole time. trying to control you yeah they have dumbed you down by these tvs and these little things and they run all that stuff twitter facebook youtube all that stuff is run by the government tesla is completely owned by the government subsidized so who's the government pay it's us the people yeah so all these politicians can make their money in the investment yeah. Don't care that this stuff's all going to be in the trash soon. Nope. It's not going to work. I can't believe how, how dumb you people have become, truly. High schools don't teach anything anymore. Middle schools don't teach anything anymore. No, no woodworking. No construction. They could be building building things at their school. Have like a, you know, and actually sell that. You know what I'm talking about? They could actually do things like that. Like, I'm telling you, man, when you build something... And, and do it with their own hands and stuff, man. You get done, you see that, and then it get used, and it really does build something inside you, you know? And you keep it with you. Make a nice, do, do nice, I mean, it's just using your hands and creating things, you know? Especially useful things. Oh. Um, yeah, everything's going to happen when it's going to happen. And there's no rush. No. But it's just I, I, so irritating to be in this little neighborhood here and just watching all the idiots around me. Yeah. It is surrounded. All of them are tests. So every one of them, all my neighbors, no matter what I did, anything, you know, I, it's just crazy. The more you do for people, uh, and I, I wasn't really, I just did it because I enjoyed it, you know, I enjoyed it, even if they didn't fucking preach it, whatever, you know, but God, I got so bad. It was like everybody was just so, just so selfish and just vile. Yeah. They think they're better than you because they have a house or this house or a bigger house or a better car. No, that don't make any anything. And it's funny, all these people, you know, I've been in over 40 fights, never lost. And, um, but probably 200 at least that I've bitched people out. But, you know, they started, but I, they see when... Once they see what a, how a real man reacts, they step wet. They back down. Sad. Yep. So I only had to fight. You know, do the percentages, you know. Out of 250 times, maybe. You know. Only 50 had to go to Dukes. <clears throat> yeah. But I was always prepared. So... These school, these teachers in these schools are bullies. Yeah. Yeah. Need to have like cameras in there and need to be monitoring these people. They're twisting your kids. Couple years in high school with a bad teacher. They're not, they're, everything you've done is just, has been, has been, you know, sad. They'll come, they, they come back. Yeah, but it sucks that, you know, it's usually when they're older, they go, God, I can't believe that. I can't believe that, you know? She's even starting to see it now. But, um, it's just so sad. Hateful people. You know? This isn't love. This isn't how humans act. There's billions of fucking different places in the world, in the universes. Yeah. 
And this is one of the hardest. Yep. So give it, think about it. All right. It's one of the hardest. So why is there certain things down here? I can't wait to all you nasty people like we're stomping on roaches, going out of your way to step on spiders and all that. Because the, the lower parts of you, when you die, when you go well, <laughs> when you transform, because your conscious comes with you. All that stuff, all them, all those, all those, the beings are around you. So they're, they're watching, they're paying attention to what you're doing. Yep. So when, when you pass, you go through it, you're judged, but you're judged through the whole, your whole, you're by yourself. The multiple beings in you. Yep. Yep. The ones you wouldn't listen to. Yep. They'll be the judges. Yep. Yep. You'll feel it. They're watching too. That's what I'm saying. They're all here. Yep. So many different things going on. You guys are just listening to the, the next thing on Twitter or this or that. This foolishness. Those black officers. I'm telling you, man, what do you think? It's not a it's not a white and black thing, dude. It's a weak man thing. Yeah. Strong men don't do that. Nope. Weak ones do. Yeah. Now, it's not about physical shit, but your brain. Yeah. Weak people. They're cruel. So, I figured I'd tell you, World War Three. you asked for it. Russia has been getting God's impulses, the Christ, everything. They are protected. Believe me. Do you think that we've been all this work in to let you come in <clears throat> and mess it up? No. <laughs> so bring it on. Because what's going to happen now is we're just going to expand. And that's going to help. Because then we'll get rid of this foolishness. All this money and greed. We'll get rid of it. Corruption. Yeah. God bless all those people fighting over there. Feel bad for both of them, really. But, yeah. Because the front line, that's not the, they're not, the Nazis are in the back. So, and those people in the front can't leave because they'll get killed. Yeah. It's crazy, man. They're killing, they're murdering, they're murdering. Yeah. All over money. So your politicians, look at it. Also, your politicians can have another car, another house, another whatever. Yep. Congress and the Senate needs to be disbanded. Yep. FBI gone. CIA, all of it. Yep. It's coming. So, believe me, I'm, I'm, I'm wanting. I'm ready. Mm-hmm. For anything. So... Just figure I tell y'all. God bless.